Okay, this vid, I'm showing something that I added to this motor. Uh, this time we're running it off of batteries. This is a Radio Shack uh, piece that they have this electroluminescent strip lighting. Um, uses two AA batteries. Push button puts out 160 volts at one watt output. Right now we're probably right around that one watt output. It puts out AC. It goes into these diode bridge rectifier. Uh, two 22 microfarad caps in series because they're 100 volts each, so it's 11 microfarads. And then uh, the positive and negative come over here. I just threw a one microfarad cap in there. Not that it really makes a difference with all this high ohm stuff. And the reed switch. Um, well, it's pretty good. Got some torque. Um, not going real fast. I don't have a piece of tape on it. I didn't think about that before I started this. Uh, but got power. Uh, 160 volts. And that's not continuous to the motor because the sweet reed switch is on and off. Um, we got this here. This is a thing. It's like a. Got it out of a kit that someone gave me that someone did some telephone work or something, but you press the button and you can hear things. They bring it near this, but you can hear that high. The high squeal, that's this thing. And when you press this button again, it'll go on and off voltage. You'll see it drop and then go up. And when we press this, you can hear it. And when we press it again, it does a faster flashing for the electroluminescent light. But you can hear that. Um, and then we turn it off and we can hear it just a moment. I guess if you put a radio near it, you'd hear all this stuff also. Let me turn this back on. And just fires up again. Uh, just wanted to show that. Uh, trying to run it at higher voltages and see where we're at. I'm, I'm going to have to measure the current that's being used in these batteries. I got some pictures uh, of the insides of this. It's a very simple little thing has a four pin chip on the bottom of it probably programmed you know to do the operations of the button for the on off and then blinking and then faster blinking but neat little thing to mess around with have a little higher voltage supply you know around that runs off of a couple of double a batteries but coils don't get warm um, figure it's about one watt that we're using here. Let's see if put, put this thing on. Let it rest. Got power. Push a little harder. I push harder and the voltage goes down. So it's pulling more because the reed switch is on longer. But just wanted to show that. Thought that was pretty cool. Alright, thanks.